Well, we got some gas in it now, some antifreeze, no belt on the pulley system because there's no alternator and there's no belt. So we'll go for a short booze cruise and see how this thing goes. It's too bad we gotta destroy this thing. It actually looks nice. There's probably some people in the world who would like a car like this. Especially with those optional brake rotor, you know, cooling system that's only in Canada, eh? Let's do her. Well, if it starts again. Oh, that window's been down for a couple years too. The seat's a bit wet. I may need to dry my ass off a bit afterwards. Does it work? Oh, it works. Wonder why they left it down. Anyways, let's try the other one. Nope. Oh well. Come on. Yes. I guess the gas gauge don't work. I put about 10 bucks in here, maybe more. not too responsive. It's misfiring. Heavy. Oh man, is this thing going to make it? with no belts. Temperature's coming up quick. Sounds like she's heavily cammed. Come on, reverse. Oh man, the short shifter crushes your fingers every time you go forward in that pocket. Come on, go baby! for a non-turbo. I wonder if it is canned. Hmm. Let's go back. We can't go too far with no belts on the system. fuel filter because it works at high RPMs. Yeah! Once she gets past 4,000, she comes to life. Ugh. Below 4,000, she's like, blah, 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 blah. Fart, fart, fart. Like, gee, like, put a fart can on and tell the world you got a problem. That's, I guess, what the guy was doing. <laughs> Check her out and see why she runs, runs like a bag of crap below 4,000. But anyways, sucks ass. Sweet. <laughs> 